Hey everyone, Woodsaw here. So I'm gonna show you my new hero, Ronan. So I'm gonna show you how, how I actually got him to devolve level 200, since a few people were wondering how I do it so fast. So this is how. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. So I was doing dungeon sweeps to level 100. And then after that, I was just using mostly books. I was actually short of some books, so I had to div the, uh, double evolve another hero and use those books. As you can see here, I have two level 5 talent boxes. So I also used them on the, this new hero. Trying to find him here. Okay, here he is. So that was actually a misclick, but no worries. So. Here we have a level 5 talent chest, we have Revite, so I actually put Revite on him. A friend of me told me it was not horrible, but actually wanted Bulwark or War God, or maybe, maybe Deadly Strike, but I'm just gonna keep it like this. So tell me what you think, should I actually change it to Scatter, or should I use my talent cards to get maybe a War God or Bulwark, so, so just let me know. So as you can see, he is already level 180. So now I'm gonna rate some bases fast. As you can see, some small gameplay of him here. He's only level one skill, so it's, he's pretty useless so far. Mainly farming gold here, since you have to do that for, for uh, leveling him up. I think that's the worst part. So rating some more bases. Just gonna show you all the way how I got him double evolved. It won't be a really long video. Also in my next video, I will make each gameplay like Arena, Lost Battlefield, Lost Realm, everything in game, some dungeons, rating some bases. So I will make videos of this new hero in all, every single game mode. So I think it will be really interesting. So here he is, level 180, evolving him right now. As I don't have backup cards, I really think he looks awesome evolved. With the fire in his eyes and mount, 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 not sure how to pronounce it. Anyway, he looks really cool evolved compared to non-evolved. So once again, we have to make some, we get, uh, we have to get some gold. Doesn't really take long to farm gold with this setup. Okay, getting him to level 80 with a few dungeon sweeps. As you can see, it goes really fast. Insane dungeon 6, 10 sweeping. Here, I, here you can see how many books I have. I actually needed, I think I needed like 100 more books, so I wasn't really well prepared, but it wasn't no problem since I, since I swept some dungeons in the end, but I didn't record that because it's really boring sweeping dungeons. This was not enough gold, so I had to ditch it. Only farming golds with like 1 million plus. Otherwise, it would take even longer. So here he is, 160 evolved, 180 evolved, same story, gold and honor badges. So I'm gonna have to sell some books here. I hope you find this useful. I'm not really sure, but this is how I normally do it. But normally I have more books and I should have like more shards also. Farming more gold, 1.8 million, which is nice. Goes really fast like this. Sometimes it's a mess getting high gold. At least we don't have the, the, the event where people always have to spend their gold. Can't really think of the name. Doesn't really matter, I think, but you know what I mean. So, 
Okay, so we are getting there. This is really the boring part. I don't like farming this, but you have to do it. Just doesn't really take long, so it helps a lot. And I think it's gonna be worth it once I'm able to play him, play him in game. I think he's gonna get really good in Lost Battlefield since he's gonna hide and go nuts. That's what I'm thinking, like Scatter wouldn't really be a bad idea for that game mode. But I'm not really 100% sure, so let me know. So if anybody wants me to roll gems or talents for this new hero, also let me know. Here I'm double evolving him. We have 110 books. Okay, so now I'm gonna... So what did I do here? So he has 78,000 health, double evolved level 1, which is not bad. So now he's already level 100 with a few dungeon sweeps. Just gonna use all my dungeon sweeps here that I have left. Might as well use them on this hero. Okay, so now we have 100 books, we need honor badges. Otherwise, I would be in a problem getting him double evolved. I also had like, I'm not sure how many, but I think I had like 60 or 70 hero uh, Hirby monster cards. So I also use that to level him up. Plus it gives shards, so that's also pretty, really helpful. So here we go. We are almost done. Feeling some more. You really need a lot gold. Not really sure how much gold you need. I didn't really calculate it. But it's 5 million, 2 million, 1 million. So I guess you have to fall maybe for 2 times evolving. I guess maybe like 15 million gold. So it's a lot. Actually I'm gonna calculate it after this hero. I really wonder. So... Unless somebody knows, so put it in the comments, please. It will be really useful knowing it, that I don't have to calculate myself. Pretty sure some people will know. So, what talents do you guys think will be best? I saw somebody with an 8 of 8 War God, so War God probably is a good option also. Deadly Strike, Bulwark, maybe Scatter, I'm not really sure. Not, I don't think Revite is going to be the best option, but since I have it right now, I'm going to stick with it a little bit. So here he is level 160, 169. And here I sweeped him with Insane, uh, with Insane Dungeon 610 to level 200. And now I'm going to show you how I'm actually gonna get him to 9 of 10 skills so I was using all my slimes and the heroes that I rolled the greens and and blues as you saw as you see there are many greens so I wasn't really that lucky rolling the new hero too bad but I'm pretty happy that I still that I have him already so can't really complain with that so here's 8 of 10 already now it's getting a lot harder. Have to buy some shards here. But I just used all my shards since I don't really need it for an other hero right now. So I'm just gonna get him to 9 of 10 because I won't make it till 10 of 10. So. So this is how I actually did it. It took me, I think, maybe 25 minutes to double evolve him. So it's not too bad. And here 
is the new monster with 9 of 10, 169,000 health. So thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.